No, I think in light of the tragedy and, and the sympathies and the whole uh, way the world is feeling towards Michael Jackson, I think at this point the judge made a good decision in allowing the children to stay with his mom and to control the finances. But when we get over the grieving period and we're talking now about the future, uh, I think uh, the best person to have Michael Jackson's children is um, Mrs. Jackson, the lady the nurse that he has the two children with and perhaps she could even have the other if the other mom does not want to appear. Um, I think she is responsible, I think that she is capable, I think that uh, she is the best person. Uh, I mean, Jacko had his, um, you know, idiosyncrasies and he had all kinds of stuff and so forth and he was able to manipulate situations and have full control but in the lieu of his demise She's the best person to be responsible for the children's future. I mean, notwithstanding the uh, reports of how um, Jackson's parents treated them and, and, and the discipline and the amount of um, <coughs> regiment and routines that they went through, I don't think um, I would like to see them do that to any other person. I think uh, Mike would have made it in spite of their uh, big set of, um, you know, military sort of brutal boot camp sort of you know um, theory um, so that um, if these kids are with them you know in my mind it's going to be are these kids going through the same thing like Mike can they handle it would they crack up you know just give them the normal life let them be with the mom they look more like the mom and the whole nine yards um, they would be able to be really who they are etc she's younger um, she's educated, you know, everything else. I think that uh, these kids should stay with uh, the mom.